the NFL. Well, John Elway was saying that Jim Kelly vouched for Chad. Oh, he and, did? Yes. All right. Okay, that's, yeah. that's what John Elway was quoted as saying. Well, so that's how that guy. goes. Like, hey, can you hire my nephew? I got a right. nephew who's looking for work. Pretty good reference, right. I At guess. your company. Right, <laughs> Anything right, we'll that. Give it a shot. It's all, it's about who you know, right? right. Yeah, it's all Sometimes, connections. Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> all right, some scattered showers in the forecast again uh, today. Uh, you might have heard some thunder last night, too. It was rumbling. A couple of those uh, heavier showers had some thunder uh, to them. You can see the precipitation for the month. Yes, we, we're, we put April to rest. And. I don't got to tell you, it was above normal uh, for precipitation. 2.67 inches above normal officially at the airport. And by the way, once we turned the page to May, we picked up six tenths of an inch more rain at the airport early this morning. Uh, so far for the year, yeah, we're way above normal. Almost five inches above normal as far as precipitation goes. All right, this is a live look in Kenosha. It is dark outside, of course, but we can't really see much because there's some fog and some rain out there. 42 degrees, the current temperature in Kenosha, currently in Milwaukee. Milwaukee, it's 41 degrees with a northeast wind at 14 miles per hour. So it is chilly out there this morning as well. Across southeastern Wisconsin, some spots in the 30s, 37 in West Bend, 37 in Waukesha, 40 this morning in Watertown. Let's go through the weather headlines. Rain will be a bit more scattered today, again, becoming hit and miss with some showers through our day. The wind is also going to start to pick up. Now by Wednesday, we're expecting some sunshine. Storm 4 max radar and satellite across uh, southeastern Wisconsin. You can see uh, what's left of some showers that worked through last night, working well north of us up towards Green Bay. A couple more showers developing to the southwest of us across southwest Wisconsin, northern Illinois, knocking on the door in Rockford, and eventually these will expand into southeastern Wisconsin. So as we go through our future forecast, 10 o'clock, again, you'll see that things are very, very scattered here through the day, maybe picking up again around uh, the 3 o'clock hour this afternoon. You can see a pretty good batch of showers moving through. Still some showers and light rain around at least for the first half of tonight. And then just a slight chance of showers popping up during the day on Tuesday. You can see again Tuesday even more scattered. So I think most of the day on Tuesday is dry. Look what happens by Tuesday night. The skies clear out. How much additional rain are we talking about? Well, I think by Tuesday afternoon, we're looking at anywhere from a quarter to another half inch of rain across southeastern Wisconsin. Your forecast for today, high temperature 54, cloudy and breezy with some scattered showers on and off. For tonight, a low temperature of 40 degrees, breezy with scattered light showers. And here's your seven day forecast now. As we head into Tuesday, just a slight chance of showers. Wednesday, look at that. There's the sun, mostly sunny for your high temperature, 56 on Wednesday, 57 on Thursday. Friday, more clouds, 50 degrees. And unfortunately, this weekend, Saturday's not looking so good. Some showers with a high temperature of only 48 degrees, 52 degrees on Sunday, <laughs> with mostly sunny skies. Not good. <laughs> Wrong That's direction with attempts. Understatement, yes. Brian. <laughs> it's 